Welcome back, folks. We are hooking up Yonkers today. Last time we did a bunch of line maintenance all the way down to Green Bay, and we did the ships as well and the trams. So we did all of these lines, we did all of these lines, and they're actually more of them are starting to make a little bit of money now, which is nice. I think the Topeka Circle we can make it maybe take down, but we'll see. And and then we did all of the road vehicles down to Green Bay. There's still a lot to do, but it's fine for now. Hopefully they'll start making some money. All right, so Yonkers, we are going to work on you today. We're going to build a double train station here going up to Lubbock. So we already built the uh, the rails here. Let's just smooth this out a bit. Goes like that. So we have passengers here and then we'll have that going in there. Why are you sitting there? I think you need to turn around. Oh, no, you don't. Where? What's going on? I mean... You should be able to get out. Go. We have all the trains sitting here. Why? Hopefully this will fix it. Alright, you're going. Hopefully they don't do that again. That's weird. Uh, three, four, five, six trains on there. Well, they're going now. Let's see what happens here. You are unloading. Then you load. And then you'll go, right? So that train is waiting there. And you're going. Okay. I wonder what happened there. I wonder what happened there. All right, well, they'll spread out as time goes along. All right, let's put this train station in here. I'm kind of thinking of doing something a little bit crazy. And putting it right smack in the middle of town. Um, for the passengers. And using uh, the curved station here. No. Something's going on with the game. I think the game crashed. It doesn't like some of these mods, unfortunately. Yeah, the game crashed.
The game crashed. All right. Uh, I'll be right back. All right. So we are back in the game. It is no longer crashed. We will let it play on for a little bit. Let's just see if we saved after we fixed this. Uh, we did not. So let's reverse you. And that is now fixed again. I'm not sure why it does that. Okay. So we're not going to do the, the fancy train thing. We are going to do a regular old uh, passenger. Uh, actually, I think I want to do this modular passenger terminus. Uh, with one track, 320 meters, because we don't have any other cities out here that we need to connect. So this is definitely a terminus. And we're going to make it to the two separate train stations. Now the passenger terminus... kind of like to get in here. I think this would be cool. So... Let's do a bit of bulldozing. All right. So that we come right in here. Um, what are we colliding with here? Like that. Yep. And we'll put a... Uh, Passenger station uh, passenger single terminal. I don't like that it's single terminal. Two lanes, bus, tram. I like this one. Can we get it in here? Can. All right, so we're going to get it in here. Like that. And it's going to be instead of this stop, obviously. Okay. So that's that station in. Then we need uh, cargo, terminus, or do we want it to be a terminus? I think actually I want this to be a through station and I want it to have at least four. Because there's a lot of cargo here. High-speed catenaries. So if we put you in here, I think that's fine. Because I'm kind of thinking that we could have brains picking up stuff out here and bringing it in here. Okay. So that... I know I said I wanted uh, it all to be trucks, but I think s having some routes like these two grade two uh, uh, farms, I think it's good to have as trains. We have some iron that we could do as train as well. We have oil, oil crude, and an oil refinery. So there's a lot that we could do with trains here. And I think that'll be fine. We could also sail, for instance, uh, this oil and this iron ore, probably this iron ore, we could sail up to here 
or this train station and expand that. So there are options. There are options. All right. Um, let's get some tracks in. High speed with catenaries. And I guess we're going through, straight through that forest. That's okay, though. I can live with it. And then I think we'll come through like this. And we need a second. So let's bring that out. And running alongside. You know what? Let's just bring this up all the way. I do not want that. Eesh. Okay, how long is this bridge going to be if we make it? <laughs> it's all the way over there. Uh, that, that's really not what I want. That's really not what I want. Where'd it go? There. Um... Let's refund all this. And if you can hear an ambulance right now, my apologies. Something is going on. Let's pull this way back here. Okay. High speed. We are going to go up a little bit. Yes. Let me flat here. And then I really want to go through here. And not come out at a place where we need a... Right, so... I think instead of doing that tunnel, because I don't think that's going to work... I think we're going to come around this way. Oh, that goes all the way over to there, okay. So we need to come around this way. Please don't collide now. Right. Jeez. What if we did a tunnel like that? Let's try this real quick. And then... Come down this way. Let's do 199 is probably fine. Might need the contours here. Alright, this is good. This is working. Um, let's just come back a tiny bit here. Alright. 
Mm. Yeah, this is good. Uh, let's do 120. And then we can actually run up alongside these rails. So... Like that. I would have kind of liked to come over and run along alongside the road. But that doesn't seem to be a possibility. Okay. Now you... Let's do... Let's do... 180. You need to come over and run alongside here. It's maybe a little bit too close. Uh, right, that'll do. And then I'm in the tunnel here. And come up here. Okay. We do the same. Like that. And then And come in here and come up here. All right. Let's build it. Okay. Now I hope we can get past here. I think we can. Let's try it. Do, 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 do. Come on. I don't want to go further than there. We're going straight through the forest, which I was... I said I was going to try and avoid, but it is what it is. Yeah, I think we can make it. Yep. No problemo. All right. How far will you go? How far? Right, uh, I think we'll quickly destroy this. Alright, and we are already paused, so that's fine. Uh, let's just pull that back a little bit more. Alright. Okay. Go in and come in here. Right, let's. Uh, the, they're complaining right now because of the missing link. So come in there. Uh, and you need to come in there. That'll do. 
Okay, now this... Could we get this going in a bit of a nicer way? I'm kind of thinking either a tunnel or a bridge. Uh, I think we can. If we pull it back here a bit. And wh why, why do we have grams on here? Why do we have electric tram stops on here? I don't get that. Okay. Well. Uh, no. Uh, it's this. Tram track, no. I don't know why we have tram track on this. I hope we don't have trams going here. We might have. It would be weird if we did, though. Yeah, we don't have tram tracks. Or we don't have trams going here. So... You... Come out this way. Uh, let's build the bridge where we want it. I think kind of like there. And then we can come into this uh, road. And tram tracks in here too. I'm not using trams here. Okay. I kind of think I want it like this. I do want uh, pillars on there, though. I oh, kind of like that bridge. Let's do that. And then you come in there. And you... No. Smooth this out. So it doesn't look weird. Well, it does look a little weird anyway, but it's fine. I think that's good. And now we don't have a warning. No. And we also. have tram tracks where we don't need them. Which is good. Okay. Yeah. Why don't we instead of this weird bend First of all, let's upgrade this. Simply do that and do that. I think that's much better. Oh. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do this. Okay, I think that's much better. Uh, we need a little bit of smoothing here. And some smoothing down here, apparently. Okay. That's much better. And we need a 
junction here. Uh, we might actually not need it, but I'm going to put it in anyway. Why not? Uh, maybe that's a little bit too... Uh, but they're, they're, they're not going to be using this junction, I don't think. We do, however, need a junction down here. I'm going to start it here. And there. Then we need signals. Uh, yes, one way. Yes, auto signal. Did you do it? No. Did you do it? Yes. Okay. And then we can auto signal from here. Uh, and we do have the auto signals, so that's all good. And we want a signal down here. And then for the other one, get in there. And we have auto signals. Yes, we do. Do, do, do. Okay, let's auto signal here. Not there. And did we auto signal? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we have auto signals. So let's see down here. Like that. And that's the signaling done. So we're going to need to do something about the bus lines and Yonkers as well, but we'll deal with that later. And I also, of course, want our uh, machines here going into the train station. But right now, first things first. We have our, these two. And if we manage these lines, so you're coming in here and after Lubbock, you will be Coming up here, and then you'll go back to Lumba Lubbock. And that's that. And you will be going, so this one will be on one, and this one will be on two. All right. So that's done. Then we have this one. Manage line. After. So we're going Lubbock, Upper Olaith, uh, Murrieta Branch, Halea, Columbia. Then after Columbia, we'll go. Back to Hylia Exchange. Back to Murrieta Branch. Uh, back to Upper Olaith. Back to Lubbock. And down to Yonkers Sightings. And at Yonkers Sightings, you will stop on track number one. In here, 
So in this Lubbock, you'll be on Terminal 2, I think. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Here. That looks fine. Here looks fine. Here looks fine. And then down here. It's fine. Okay. So that means that Yonkers is now hooked up with cargo. Kinda. We need some uh need some trucks. Uh, but that's fine. And then we need a new line. From here to here and back again. And we'll make you red. And you will be Yonkers, Lubbock, Commuter. And You need a uh, depot. Buildings, depots, and we have the new modern depot, which I like. Uh, so let's put that in here. And we'll do high speed with catenaries. And this one can come over here. And go in there. And this one can come over here. And go in there. We'll make it a double slip switch on both of them. We will put in some signals. Uh, no, no, and there, and there, and then one way, yes. So we'll be coming up from here and there, and here we will be coming up here and coming down here. Okay. And this one. We need to buy some vehicles. And we have the new trains. Uh, we have some new diesel trains, don't we? Or not. Yeah, I think this one is new. 165. That's not bad. Let's add you. And then passenger will go with... West Rail West Fleet. One, two, three. Mediocre. Eesh. I think that'll be fine though. Uh, bye. We'll give you your color. And we'll set you on Yonkers Lava Commuter. Unable to find path to stop. Why is that? Oh, it's the wrong one. All right. Uh, sell you. It's uh, this one over here I want. Buy vehicles. We'll do the same thing. Diesel. You. Uh, passenger. West Rail West Fleet. 
Or do we do with the bard? Nah, we don't really need it. And we don't need to go 200. So we could go with this. This weighs 35 tons. This weighs a lot more. So one, two, three, four we can actually put on here. And still be better and have higher capacity. So that's what we're going to do. All American Gold Sands it is. There's also the Streamline New Mexico coach. I can't do the 165 though. Make you red. Set you on Yonkers Lubbock commuter. Go. And I think we'll take a ride on that train. Take a look at it. That doesn't look very red, does it? Ah, it's fine. Uh, passenger cars look red, though. All right, here we go. I need to smooth this out a bit, I think. I don't suppose we have any passengers yet. Well, there are actually passengers coming. Ooh, did he get on board? I don't think he made it. No, he didn't. Two passengers. I like this train. I like this train. All right, there's our uh, depot. All right, heading up to Lubbock. This is a little, little bit of a windy road, but it is what it is. It's in the mountains, so it's to be expected. Ooh, we need to do something about that crossing there. That looks horrendous. All right. We actually have six rails running alongside each other here. It's pretty cool. I like it. It's a nice railway, yes. And these trains are going good. And do we have passengers here? We do. We do. A couple. Yeah, two. All right, very cool. So another new commuter line is up and running. Let's just take a look at this crossing. Uh, I think if we just smooth a bit, it'll be better. I mean, this, the hill is still there, but it's better. All right, now I think we need two of these trains on here. So let's manage vehicle and loan. All right, so that's that. Of course, we need some bus stops around here. And, and that'll be fine. Outstanding. And how is Lovok doing? Ooh. 597 passengers going up to Olaith. Um, what about in Topeka? 573. 400. But this was blocked up for quite a bit, so let's see if that doesn't sort itself. Um, in here, yeah, so that's the Midland. The others are fine. Uh, here, Murrieta Provo commuter. 
You don't have that many. You don't have that many. So it's really just here that we have quite a lot of passengers sitting. But I am thinking of doing a monorail like Santa Rosa, Murrieta, Olathe, Topeka, Midland, Hialeah, Columbia, maybe Sunnyvale and back to Santa Rosa to kind of take some of the pressure off the spine commuter lines. Let's turn this lag machine off. This looks fine. Ooh, that doesn't look fine. So Macula Memphis commuter. And they all want to go to Temecula. So... Let's clone you. I guess you're full, right? Yeah. The Memphis Madison commuter actually has quite a lot of passengers sitting as well. Yeah. So, where do we have a passenger train on this line? Right here. That is the Memphis Madison commuter. We will get another train on that. And then... The Madison Omaha commuter. There's no one who wants to go to Omaha or Winston Salem. Well, there's a few people. And there's a few people, so that has more than enough trains on it right now. All right. Good, good, good. So once we get. Yonkers here, if we can find Yonkers, there it is, uh, hooked up with these uh, machines and maybe some alcohol, maybe some grain, maybe some crude and some oil, then I think this will be a very, very good town. I think this will be a very, very good town. There's already 42 people waiting there. Right, we have our... Fluids coming down. Uh, let's... Make this a little bit nicer. Are you bringing passengers down? You're 19. Okay. And we have 54 waiting here. So that's not too bad. That's not too bad. And how many do you have? Only five. And we have eight waiting. So meh. I think we'll be just fine. I think we'll be just fine with this line. And there's a another train. It doesn't have anything on board, but that's to be expected. Let's have a quick look at our train lines before we end the episode, uh, just to see how they're doing. So the spine fluid hauler is doing 24 at the moment. Spine cargo 16. The Murrieta to Macula, 16 million. Tacoma, Virginia was doing like 15 or something. Uh, yeah, we're doing okay. The Virginia Beach Tacoma box hauler isn't doing so great. But I think that'll change over time. The spine fluid to Lubbock is not doing too great, but it was just extended. 
the spine stakeholder isn't doing too great but i'm pretty sure that it will start doing great uh yonkers lava of course uh, virginia tacoma virginia beach commuter all in all we are making a lot of money on our trains but yet we'll food to roseville it's a mogul all right now that is something that we need to switch out and we'll do that in the next one we will kind of run through our trains a little bit and see if there is anything that is totally outdated other than the the mogul here which is extremely outdated so yeah thank you very much for watching guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did why not leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you next time